Faces of today. Faces of yesterday. Where are they now? Famous faces and not so famous beginnings. Hello, this is Art James inviting you to enjoy some famous faces, past and present, in the wonderful world of movies and television. How many times have you said, I know that face? Or whatever happened to? On Oh That Face. In a moment, we'll meet the real person behind one of the most beloved boozers on television. The town drunk on the Andy Griffith series. Honorable Mayor, ladies of the Women's Historical Society. You got the name of the rightful descendant, have you? We certainly have. This is it, Andy. I just hope I don't cry. Yeah. <laughs> That's just a sensitive. <laughs> Who's the lucky person? The name of the rightful descendant of Nathan Tim is, um, Otis Campbell. Otis Campbell? Better than I tell you. Otis Campbell? Spread your arms out, close your eyes, and bring your hands together and touch your fingertips. Got that? Trying to see you. <laughs> All right, Otis. Honest. Honest. I got honest. Oh, pardon, pardon me. <laughs> I, I can only say, I may be wrong, but I'm not far from it. You do a lot of uh, commercials, Hal. How many commercials would you say you did last year? Radio and TV? Mm -hmm. Last year, probably a hundred and... hundred and ten, maybe a hundred and... maybe more. And a lot of character voices. Yes, oh yes. I love the character voices. That's part of being an actor, you know. What are some of the more well-known voices that you do? Well, I started out doing uh, Barney on the Flintstones. You, mm -hmm. you know the character Barney. Hiya, Fred. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I used to kid around with him a lot, you know. And then I, once in a while I'd do Fred uh, when uh, Dino, the little uh, dinosaur, would come in and say, <laughs> Dino, leave me alone, Dino! yabba dabba do, Well, ma! And, you know, kidding around with him. But I started out doing Barney. Well, I'm looking forward to hearing some of those, uh, seeing you at work and oh, well. hearing some of these voices. Could we do that now? I think it would be just great. Yeah. We got a microphone around here someplace? Oh. Uh, when you're ready for the goofy character, Hark, uh, just give me a cue, okay? Yep. I volunteered to help the kids put on their school play. <laughs> I'm pretty handy when it comes to building sets. Oh, so I'm going to the auditorium to see if the paint's dry. <laughs> then I'm going to run around the track and hit a few tennis balls. <laughs> Gotta keep them shaking up. Gosh. And, Hark, here's a pickup uh, from the owl a voice on Winnie the Pooh, okay? Cost is what you give up, Pooh. Suppose you wanted to buy Christopher Robin's balloon for 14 gooseberries. Oh, what you are really giving up is the chance to buy my jar of honey for the same 14 gooseberries. You are choosing between the two uses of your money. And maybe we can get one more here. Eeyore. <clears throat> Pick up Eeyore. Of course. I work as a laborer. I don't mind. Laborers aren't specialists, so they don't earn as much. But it's all right. I understand. I'm used to it. Cut. Did we get it? Yes, we got it. And we love it. Thank you, Hal Smith. Oh, that face. Faces of yesterday, faces of today, where are they now? Famous faces and not-so-famous beginnings, and, of course, hilarious outtakes and bloopers on Oh, That Face.